Hi everyone, this is uh, take two because I did do a video um, earlier, it did not, co uh, I wasn't able to download it on uh, YouTube so I'm doing it again and I did, I, I sorted out a problem I had as well uh, to do with, do with the uh, webcam camera. So uh, this is uh, take two and it's uh, to do with my uh, German um, uh, uh, bolt action force that I've been painting uh, for the, you know it's a S SSR I can't remember the term the warps uh, warp, uh, I can't I cannot pronounce it sorry <laughs> but uh, yeah uh, I've chosen this colour the with the camouflage really which uh, as you can see it's quite different from what you normally see I've seen similar tanks like it but um, it is different I, I, as I've, I've you know been looking at it and that and I, I, I really do like it the more I more I think yeah yeah that's fine at first I was oh I don't know but now I'm thinking yeah that's absolutely fine I'll just uh hold on a moment that's better as you can see So I put it uh, the numbers on rough uh, the SS symbol I don't feel I've got M sent right but so I'm not sure about redoing the second one the first one I the first one out there I find find the second one I don't feel lightning simple I don't think I quite got it right as you can see I've done the German markings and that If there's any inaccuracies uh, to do with uh, to do with this, please tell me, and I will correct anything you think. Yeah, it's just not right, nowhere near right, and uh, you've got to just change that and this. I don't mind criticism when it comes to this. I will uh, show you some of the other stuff that I've done as well. In a moment. It's my uh, German commander. I'm not sure about just uh, putting a, a, a thin wash of nun oil on it or, or leave it as is. I think it's fine actually, but I'm just not 100% sure. I should just give it a thin coat. Still got to finish off the base. That's alright. This one is different from uh, the other units, as you can see. I will show you a few more. Uh, it's got one standing. If I can find one. There's one. As you can see. So I can size it up, but to be honest. This was a different camouflage pattern again.
these are more traditional looking ones and I put it's a the SS symbol lightning symbols on the helmet like that I tried to do it you know the way it was the right way I seen it with that shield device but I didn't have a small enough detail brush and I haven't got any micro uh, these glasses things that you can mm, get a larger microfire a bit to be able to get the detail better but uh, still it's all right that one's turned out really quite well see with the uh, bases as well it's static grass and just uh, typical sand glued on and then painted over the uh, actually leather brown I use for that yeah, I'll just show a few more I did go over all of them with a um, wash of nano oil water down a bit the, when it comes to the stripes I'm not sure I may retry again with it because it just didn't come out as good as I would have liked it as you can see there I'm not certain so just give me an opinion on it uh, will it be all do you feel that's fine I feel I really should actually change it I just lost the transfers on it and anyway putting those sort of things on a transfer of that size onto one of them is murder so uh, that's the uh, another one Just did one that was uh, quite different, as you see. Those, just they, are a lot different from the others. I just want what it says. Just paint each unit a bit different. But these one, I use that uh, ochre, ochre ochre paint that came with the. Uh, SS um, paint set the wolf wolf it wolf uh, I can't pronounce it I do apologize uh, you know what I'm on about that set you know, it could have came with the uh, got a attachment with the tank or something colors as well actually I did mix that uh, the, the that main uniform paint myself grey and a bit of a certain green which I can't remember what I actually mixed in <laughs> typical to be honest Again, I painted a little differently. They look a bit more muddier as well because of it. Uh, to be honest, uh, to do with the machine guns uh, teams, uh, the, the frame itself, uh, it broke. I don't find it the metal uh, frame part of it very good. I think it's just rubbish. Not very good at all. I would have preferred a plastic one actually. Or just something different. Something better than the, what they throw in there. Because it's so delicate. And uh, sometimes with some of these things I'm thinking. Well, why didn't you have a 
little leaf look at the instructions it's actually something like a pack 40 which I did you know check the net and sort it out that way but it would have been just handy uh, sometimes uh, to have that uh, that's it I, the pack 40 is the only one I've got to literally paint now and that will bring me up to uh, five uh, the th thousand points I uh, still got some of the command left including the uh, the fir uh, first aid first aider uh, to do so that will be done this week because next not this Sunday but next Sunday I will be ha uh, having my first ever bolt action uh, game uh, and I've got also an English, uh, as some people know, an English uh, bolt action um, uh, force, as well as the German force. I will be using the Germans there, because I've only recently painted them. And we'll get round to using my British force as well. But at least now I've got two forces at 1,000 points at home. So if somebody wants to come down, have a game, I've got the two forces ready, already here. Uh, ready for people to play and um, yeah looking forward to uh, playing the game and yeah it should be really really enjoyable but uh, once this once I've painted this I'm gonna be doing I'll probably go to and um, paint start painting the frost grave stuff just to get away from the camouflage uh, stuff and the uh, World War Two uh, painting for a while because I need a good break and I may do I may paint some dark angels actually because uh, I got them ready to paint and there's a few other things on my uh, painting table Alice in Wonderland and uh, uh, um, uh, this world miniature to paint as well so I've got plenty to get on with uh, just loads actually because. Uh, We've got one of these to so undercoat, so I just need to paint that one at some point. And I might eventually uh, ref uh, do a refresh to so do with my uh, Warhammer Empire Army as well, because uh, some of that has, was painted well over 10, 12 years ago, and I really do would like to update the paintwork and uh, so I've improved since I first started painting them so I'm gonna get back to that and uh, 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 um, make some improvements with that army but anyway thanks for watching I will be posting some more videos up pretty soon and um, till next time